Hello everyone. Uh, we will continue the topic interfaces. In the previous video, we learned how to create a interface using SC24. We created the interface using SC24. We used that interface into two classes and we discussed interface is also exhibiting polymorphism. Now we will go for, suppose now we will learn how to create a interface using SC38 transaction code itself. Every time we are doing the same practice, we are learning the thing by SC24 then we are achieving the same thing locally also. Now what we will do, we will learn how to create a interface using the code itself or we will learn how to create a local interface which will be dedicated to that program only. So I will create a new program. I will give some name to the program. I'll click on create button. I will give the title to display sales order slash billing document details. I will take the type as executable. I'll click on save button and I will save it as a local I will take a parameter in the program e underscore v b e l n type data element and I will take two radio buttons. Our requirement is totally same but now we will achieve the requirement by using interfaces. So I took first radio button and I am taking second radio button and those all belongs to same radio button. I'm checking the syntax and activating. I will provide the selection text. This is my suppose sales document. This is my billing document. And this is my suppose input. I'm running the program. So my input screen is ready. Same to same requirement we have. If I will pass a input and first radio button is selected, I will display the sales document details. If second radio button is selected, I will display the billing document details. But now we have to achieve this requirement using interfaces. So if SC24 steps are clear, it is very easy to convert those steps in the form of code. So how to create an interface? The keyword to create an interface is interface. I will give some name to the interface. Suppose interface one. I will write end interface. <clears throat> In SC24, when you created the interface, you did the same thing. You gave some name to the interface and you clicked on the create button. Now, after that, you gave some method name and the method is instance method. So how to give a method? How to give a instance method? The keyword is methods display. We gave one importing and four exporting parameters to this method. I'll go for the same thing. One importing and four exporting. P 
So we have one importing and four exporting parameters. If you remember, whenever we did the class, we always use the word public section. But now interface, there is no provision to give public, private, and protected because in interface, all methods are public by default. So there is no need to give public section. This method is public by default. I'll check the syntax and I'm activating the program. So my interface is ready. Now, after that, what you did in SC24, you created a class and in that class, you use that interface. We will do the same thing. Suppose I'm writing class sales definition end class. Now I will use the interface into this particular class. I will write public section and in SC24, you simply went to interfaces tab and you pass the interface name. I will use the same, same concept interfaces. And what is my interface name in this case? Interface one. So I used the interface into this particular class. After that, if you remember, when we went for methods tab, how our interface method is displaying in the class? Interface name tilde operator method name and you wrote the logic in that particular method. How we will do? We will do the same thing. If I want to write the logic, I will write class sales implementation. Now, if you remembered, now I will not write method display end method and I will write the logic. I will not go by that way because how our interface method is displaying, it is interface name tilde operator method name. So this is the way how I will write. So I'll simply write method. What is my interface name? This is interface name. And what is the method name? Method name is display. And I will write end method. In the previous videos, you created a subclass from the existing class. In that case, you created the subclasses from the existing class. Now, rather than classes, we have now interface and with the end, we are using the interface into those classes. So if I will show you the program in which we use the classes, you will easily able to relate it. Suppose if I will show you the program which we created previously. If you remember, this is interface. I'll go to some other program. Yes. In that case, we simply wrote the method and we wrote the code. But in that case, from a existing class, you are creating subclasses. Now, in case of interface, how you will call that particular method of the interface? interface name tilde operator method name. Now I will write the code in this particular method. Same, I will fetch the data from VBAK table, select single ER that ERZDT ERNUM 
VB type from VP AK into I will pass the column names PER that PER ZET PER num PVB type. And I will write the where condition. So this is the way. Now we wrote the code to fetch data from VBAK. Now we will create a after that. If you remember what we did, we created a second class. And we use the same interface into second class also. And we wrote the code to fetch data from VBRK. Same to same thing we will do. Rather than writing it again, I'll simply copy paste. And now what is my second class name billing? I'm creating a implementation of second class. Now interface name tilde operator method name. Now the table is VBRK and I will just follow the practice. Best coding practices is follow the sequence. So many times we discussed, there's no difference as such, but just we are following the best practices. I'll check the syntax and I will. So what we did in this particular video we learned how to create a interface local interface using sc38 transaction code there's no need to give public section because in interface all methods are public by default we use that interface into two classes first class name is sales another class is billing how the interface method will be appearing in the classes interface name tilde operator method name now rest part will continue in the next video thank you